Oxo is a year old and has only just learnt to swim. It's been a cold spring so I've waited until the water has warmed up. The dummy delivery is a bit messy and I correct her if she spits it out but my priority is for her to be happy and keen so I let her chase the dummy which stops her becoming too fussy about the entrance and the footing. I have had her down here with other dogs but she gets incredibly excited and doesn't have much focus on what I'm saying to her so you just have to work it out. So having had a few retrieves in the shallows, I take her round to the gap where she first swam, where she's got confidence, and I'll let her repeat that for a few more days. They have a lot to learn. She's keen to get in and then gets her head underwater and gets water in her ear and gets in a panic. So, you know, they've just got to learn the technique. But do be sure to keep a good delivery. The habit so often acquired at the water of spitting the dummy out can be a difficult one to break. So we had a similar routine the next day, and then the day after that, I tried her on a different entrance. Interestingly here, she wanted to stay on the weed, she felt safer, so if something like that happens, don't correct them or try and redirect them, just let them work it out. It's very early days, she's learning to swim, she needs to learn how to negotiate all the rubbish that's in the water, and how to pick up the dummy and turn and carry it. I'll use this pond for about a fortnight, and I'll want her to be going in pretty well without hesitation before I go to a different location where I'll start to introduce things like a flow, steeper entrances or perhaps much colder water. It's just really important that it's always a good experience.